Hey everyone, this is Nancy. Welcome back to live tutorial from Glitz Accessory and such. And it's just usually odd time. We usually go live on Thursday and Friday. Just this week is so special because we have really special promotions. Black Friday, I would like to come and just share with some of uh, design. Hello, hello, Yoka. Hi, Gio. Do I say it right? Paku. Hello, Instagram. Thanks so much for tuning in. Welcome back to our live tutorial. Today, I'm so excited. I just would like to share so many different uh, designs. Um, just basically from crystal or from really simple designs that you can do it, achieve it really fast and um, easy at your salon. So even your beginner is really easy for you to achieve this look or if you're advanced, you can get some ideas then apply it on for your clients. So we'll give it a minute and let me share for a minute. For if you if you are watching and you don't have much time to watch, you can always share it and save it later and watch it later once you have a minute. Um, it's gonna be really cool. I'm excited. So when you ladies. Um, purchase any products then all of your orders gonna be if it fall into any categories of the giveaway which is the extra for this year that we're doing besides really uh, awesome promotion 30% off so yours on the, I think it's on the 6th that's the day that we announce the winner so when you have an order you don't have to worry about anything we'll take care of it but your order number is that the number that they're gonna draw it so how are you from Venezuela? Oh my goodness. Thank you so much for tuning in. Hello, the salons. <coughs> Thank you, everyone. Time is shines. How are you? So today is really simple, basic. We're going to probably do it with um, crystal placement. I just play a little bit with this one. It's really cool. I'm going to put the neon pigments on it. It's so fun. I'm just using it with the weaver gels, with our weaver gels that I have it right here on my hand. And it's two colors. I have it's pure white, and this is the crimson red. It's just fun, cool things for uh, Christmas coming. And I'm going to put some neon and put some crystal on it. But this one, I'm going to do it in a little bit. But... Um, Let's do this colors. I really like this blue though. Somehow it's cobalt blue. So you can use it on the gel polish. When you apply the crystal um, designs on, you can do it on the gel polish. You can do it on the dipping and powder. You can do it with acrylic uh, lubricant powders. So just only a different lubricant powders. Or, and then a dipping can always, is the best way to have the crystal stay on really nice. You can always um, apply it once just one coat of a uh, beige gels and then key it for 10 to 15 seconds and then after that you're gonna apply the glue gels but this time i have just the color of the gel polish so after two coat of gel polish i'm gonna go ahead and apply the glue gels this is really awesome it's a condensed glue gel i say condensed because it's a thick density so then it will hold your flat back crystal as well as your 3d also, your uh, nail art charms that you have on any piece of charm. Matter of fact, that I have it on my nails. I'm going to get changed my nails. I know as you've been like really tired of looking at my nails for the last few live video, but it's been three weeks. None of the pieces come off. They stay on. And then even this piece, they stay on really good. So you can hold like even the big veils like that. The chandelier is still intact on my nails because the con condensed glue gels and precision glue gels that's all I need for you know doing my crystal placement I will share with you how you can do that and achieve really easy and nice look I'm gonna using condensed glue gels in the 5g part which has come with the um, Black Friday <coughs> excuse me exclusive crystal kit 
and it's just it's not cell level you can see that I just put it upside down it's not runny at all so let's make it even easy so I'm only using my twin tip brush is a dual uh, end so it's one end is my gel brush and then the other end is my light brush so it's really convenient all right so I'm gonna just add just a smaller generous amount if you need more you can always go back and get more I have uh, Lily and Isabella my daughters they are joining me over here this awesome help next to me because it surrounds me is so many different products and so I apply all and tie the nails you know what I suppose to show you with chromes but I already did the crystal it's okay we'll do a next one I'm so excited I can't wait for the crystal that's why I going I have the chromes right here chromatics this is beautiful blues I want to put it on the top of it of the nails but it's okay we'll do it in the next one So Yoka gone we're gonna probably respond it to you. You say the promotions or what is we can send you the message in a little bit, I guess. Cause we're trying to have a team to translate it for it. Hello Instagram, thanks so much for tuning in. And I'm gonna clean this one, wipe it up, and then caps on. And um you see, I wanted doing the best way to doing it, put the mat, the, I'm sorry, it's a non-white, no white top coat on the top of glue gel. I haven't cured glue gel yet. I will cure it later after I finish with all that crystal placement. So float it on the top of your condensed glue gels. I don't do it heavy handed because I don't want them to drag my glue gels away. So then that's why I put it gentle floating on the top of my condensed glue gel. Crystal picker, which is you want to get it with your kit. Your uh, Black Friday exclusive kit, this is everything you need for even the beginner or advanced. Advanced is going to be like something is really cool to add on your collection of your crystals. But for beginner, it's a great, and you get a big bangs for your bucks. Like, it's so many crystals in here for the value of less than $150, which is only $139 after your discount and everything. So, such a great promotion for you guys. All right, so then I'm going to do, what do you feel like? I have a red. Maybe I should do a red, huh? What color should I do? I think this one looks good though. But hey, let me do a red though. <coughs> we did a red yesterday. Let's see. What about this bow? Okay. Oh, I know what I want to do. Super cute. Maybe I'll do it diagnose a little bit. And now I'm going to fill it in. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Right here. Media Luna. <coughs> Tease me. And then another piece of media luna. Let me go that way. I'm just gonna do it like have a diagonal like that. Now I'm gonna fill it in. It's so cute. Hey, hi Henry, how are you? easier to seeing it hi Instagram 
All right, so I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add the SS10. I'm going to add S8. It's a freestyle. And I can show in one of the simple ones later, once we have time. Just so sparkle. You will never go wrong with this. Wipe on the side. I keep continue to add it on. So I am going to using So I am going to use Give me one second. It's SS I am using it right now is SS8. <coughs> Excuse me. Hello, Henry. How are you? Just move it. It's hard to see it from here, but I will try to get it. And I'm just place them randomly when you're doing it at the salon. It's really easy if you're doing it right uh, next to your clients. You can just place them randomly with the different shape. Or you can just place them with just one special shape if you prefer. But I just so in love with this look of different special shape. You can see I can pick two of them at the same time. And what using this is I I believe it's a six S S six. It's S S ten for the stone side. I'm gonna do this one and I'm placing on now I'm gonna go into SF4 to fill in and then I'm gonna use some metal beads the gold metal bead to fill it in. Yes, nails by Yazi. Yes, you can use it on the dipping powder. What it, I said it earlier, when you're using dipping powder after you finish with dipping powders, do not put the number three or number four on yet. If you're using a system of a gels, like a glue gel, condensed glue gels, it would hold really, really strong in on top of the dipping powders. So what you need to do is after you buff and send the clients to wash the hand, you're gonna using a gel polish, the base gel polish, and then you're gonna apply it on the key for 10 seconds. And then you're gonna using condensed glue gels and then a non, no white top on the top of it. Then you place your crystal, then you key. It will keep the crystal stay on really intact on the client's nails without worrying about pop they're popping off or anything else very soon is Lily gonna joy with me doing a live video Jenny will be back with you next week but this week today and tomorrow I will come and share with you all different cool designs so here's a tip and tricks 
I'm using my twin tip brush. Just the other the other end is, and I'm gonna pick my bead. Look at that. I can pick so many of them at the same time, and don't worry about it. I'm gonna move them using my the other end of my uh, crystal pickers. I'm just placing right there where I want them to be. And I'm gonna using, as I say, I'm gonna using my crystal picker and move them the way I want it. But I make sure I get them all good. Let's see. <coughs> I'm gonna use this end, okay? It's the dot tool also is the wax on one side. So I already have a glue gel, a condensed glue gel. It's going to hold my metal beads. It's staying really good. I just love this little beads. It just really add it on and make it like a jewelry instead of just a plain crystal. This is nice and you add it on the crystal on is one thing. You're my favorite nail artist and inspired. Thank you so much. You are my favorite nail artist and inspiration. Thank you so much for sharing with us your technique. Thank you so much. I'm so glad you ladies, you are enjoying it. Any question, any comments, please don't hesitate to just comments below. Ask any question you were thinking that you were not asking. We'll be here for you. We'd love to share with um, everyone and wish everyone doing great, really successful at what you're doing. Make good money, is work smarter, not harder. We we'll love you all. Looks cool though. I don't know, the nails are so beautiful. Now I pick from this. Maybe I need that to you, twin tip brush. So addicted to that twin tip brush because they pick so fast. All of them. Just need to add a few of them more, I think. Just really nice. Thank you so much, Ang Henry. You are my favorite. I haven't pulled a lot of shape in my kitty goals. That's awesome. You make me so proud, Ang Henry. Keep up the good work. It's really, it's really nice. Today, I got one of the clients who were asking me. Um, she's followers on, I think it's Google, Instagrams. But she asking, how long have you, it take you to master all of this up? And I said, you know, be honest, I still learning as of today. So, I still learning for past 20 years. I keep looking for a good technique. So then, when I apply, I see it's successful in there. I would love to share. And let's see. It's so beautiful. I don't know how to stop. You see that? It's like, just keep going. But let me add a couple more right here. To, to make it look finished. I think I'm good though. I should keep going because there's like, if you have all solid blue, like cobalt blue for Christmas, just one ring fingers, it's gonna make it so fancy look. So I like that. I can't, I can't wing the nails without having blinks on it, you know me. Hello, it's a glad to see you all. Thanks so much for tuning in, darling. I just using all this uh, crystal from the, Black Friday closet kit. 
which is I'm using the bows, the mega bows, which is awesome. You can do it in different angle. You can do it diagonal, you can do it straight, you can do it, it's just like however you want the way it look. And then Media Luna that I put on the sides and then I added on side SS10s and SS8 and 6 and all the metal beads. Just make it look so cool. All right, I'm gonna pop in the lamb. If you're happy with this, and make sure to hear the tip and trick. When you do this crystal placement, doesn't matter what design you're doing, the more like they are um, connect together, the tighter they connect together, better it's gonna be because no one can break it apart. It's gonna stay in the same place. And when you have the cleanse gear, the hands just make sure they are turning like back and forth a little bit, so then all that. LED ray gonna able to cure completely through on the size of the crystal. Okay, 60 seconds in the lamb. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry you guys, I was like quick. This kit, this kit is after the 30% off, it's totally automatically take out. Totally you only pay $139.30. dollars I believe, and plus your um uh, shipping or tax but it's such a great it's four hundred dollars value um, but you only get it for 130 and also it's come with the diamond dust pixie and, and I will show you in a minute is come with the Christmas diamond dust pixie which is have the red and the green in it you will also receive your glue gel 5g glue gel your crystal pickers and then your tray two trays and then your scoops so then you can scoop your crystal out without scratching it so so convenient that's everything you need if you are a beginner it's just great investments for like less than 150 dollars but then you get so many crystals like you have so many you have so many ss4 6 8 10 and all different special shape each shape it's have 20 pieces in there so you have so many you have like or 20 of them 19 of them also you have your um your rose gold your rose gold right here it's all the mixed shape from ss3 to ss16 you also have <coughs> excuse me the neons crystal you can see that and then a glow in the dark crystal so many of uh 3d that's if your clients come in love cardi b nails you can doing similar nails like that and here is Diamond Dust Pixie. Let me open it. It's uh, <coughs> so beautiful. It looks really gorgeous in, in person when you open it. And you put some of the asset. Maybe we should do that, right? Should we do that? Should we do the Diamond Dust Pixie in the next nails? I work with So Nails by Jazzy. Did I say right? I work with SNS instead of putting the gel top. Can I use a glue gel for crystals? Yes. So instead of you putting the top, uh, hold on. Are you talking about gel top, which is the dipping gel top? Or are you talking about the gel LED light? LED gel top. Are you talking about um, the dipping solution gel top? Yes. Okay. So if you're using <coughs> your dipping powder, if you have dipping powder, you're going to apply after the dipping powder before you put number three and number four, you're going to apply one coat of the base gel, which is the LED base gels first, here for 10 seconds. And then you're going to apply the glue gels then the nun's white top coat. Don't key anything yet. Just float it on the top of the condensed glue gels. Then you place your crystals. And then after you're happy with your crystals placement, you're going to pop in the lamp. Dipping gel top. This uh, goodness nails, this is not Swarovski crystals. This is Glitz crystal and it's the highest selections and the highest quality of crystals. 
So is Swarovski crystal is a brand, and then we have the Glitz crystal. So you can check it out if, um, if you haven't checked it out. The crystals is the products that we have. Is a great um, investment. The great, really good investment for you to check it out. The you can see that the sparkle of it, the cut will have a different cut, and it might have some of. The tacky, did you wipe it off? You did? Didn't it? Okay. All right. So now we're going to go in with the glue gel, pre seasoned glue gels. It's the dual end. I'm going to take this off because I love this size. It's so convenient and easy. So at first, you're going to feel this first. Don't squeeze anything because this little bottles go a long way. It's gonna last so long. So I'm gonna feel any edges right here. This glue gel can go on the top of the metal beads, but you try to avoiding it going to the crystal, but then it's really nice because the needle is so fine thin. You can go to tiny little um, gap right there without touching a crystal. So I'm gonna start feeling it. If I feel that scratchy right here, I'm gonna go in and feel with it. So it's gonna go in between all the gaps and edges and it's, it's spread the glue gels. Oop, next didn't get in there. And it will seal it. So then it pre it's preventing from the clans that catching on their clothes or their hair. It just really helped them uh, wearing this. We have so many clans, so it was like three, six weeks. Some of them will go on vacation, come back six weeks later. They are still intact. None of them will come off. And they can go right here. <coughs> Excuse me. Right in the edges right there. Without touching my crystal. Right here. Because you don't want to touch all the crystals. Because it's going to take away from the cuts. Of your beautiful crystal. So I think it's good. And then I'm going to pop in the lamb. Here's a one tip and trick. If you feel accidentally, if you're a little bit extra, you can use a twin tip brush again and just gently clean it up the excess glue, wipe it, and blend them out. So then, when after you cure, you don't feel your designs feel like lumpies and then it just doesn't look attractive. So I'm gonna just wipe it off the excess off and blend them out. And then, if I'm happy with this, I'm gonna pop in the lamb. Let me see if people can see it closer. Yep. Perfect. Yes, so we just till down, but don't squeeze until you squeeze it. It will flow down. When you feel the nail first, the edges and scratchy, and then you squeeze just a little bit, but don't squeeze it at first. You're gonna feel it first before you squeeze anything out because you don't want to flood your crystals. Thank you so much, Nails by Ja. Do they say Jassy? No, it's Yahtzee. Yahtzee? No, it's Yahtzee. It has a Y in it. Okay, all right. My daughter, she's a really good support and assistance. And she's good. All right, I'm going to close this one. Don't lose this because you're going to want to close it so then it won't spilling or accidentally cure your uh, glue gels. Cap on. I'm going to open the other end so then you can see it. This is a brush. Yes, you said it right. Who said it right? It's me, me or my daughter. Me. <coughs> it's me. Isabella. Her name is Isabella. <laughs> She's so sweet. It's a glitzy wall. That's fabulous.
they all done excuse me i'm like just have a dry coughing because it's kind of uh, hot and cold here in florida look at that they are so sparkle and i use all the crystal from that kids <laughs> she said ha ha both whoops <laughs> Hello, Mona. Thanks so much for joining in. All right. So move on to the second nail. So what would you like, would you ladies would like to see? You want fusionings? You want to see fusioning on this? Simple fusioning. Oh, weaver gel. We can do weaver gel. You want to see the cool tip and trick with weaver gel? Okay. You... Okay, my daughter said this. I shouldn't decide. Just let you all pick. Can you? Anyone would like to see something? Um, we can do. We can do uh, weaver gel. Would you like to see the weaver gels? How I using tip and trick with weaver gels, and we can put some crystal on it. That would be so cool. Maybe we should do with a gel, huh? Should we? Okay. I don't know. No, hold on. Let's do with the gel on this one. We should wait and. Okay. We should see if they pick. You have to. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna do with a gel then, and then I will do Can some you crystal. Us on one of the Can you show us on one of the dipping? I don't have the dipping powder at the moment. But then when you, after you're done with like, for instance, if after you're done, this is a dipping powder before you have your number four, number three and number four, you're going to do it's a dipping with like you buff it off, you wash the client's hand and then you put the, you're going to put the base gel first and cure the LED base gels and you cure it for 15 seconds. Then you put your glue gels, the glue gel, like, and after that, you're going to be the same it's the gonna same uh, procedures. I'm gonna text you. Um, we're gonna go ahead and text you later after live videos, and we'll text you step by step how to do that with the dipping powder. Yeah, Z, right? Did I say right? Yeah, Z. Okay, don't drink that. Okay, and then we're gonna probably doing it. Um, let's do some weaver gels first, and then I will show you how to do the reindeer. How about that? The Rudolph the reindeer, I like that. Okay, we're going to moving on the weaver gels. What should we do weaver gel with the red one? Let's do the red one. The red colors, right here. I have it right here, but I'm gonna open the ones. It's so cute. I got her name right again. Okay. Yes. You got it right. <laughs> That's fabulous. Awesome. Okay. Tip and tricks really cool. Um, you can put all your toothpicks. It's really fast and easy. And then this doesn't cost you anything to make this two at all. I put five or four um, toothpicks together and then I tape it. You know, I use I tape ton of them ready for me when a busy season. I just grab one and doing it. And you can do it in two sides. I using the blue on this size and then I using this for the red or the white and then after you're done you just like tot it away you don't have to worry about washing or do anything at all you said tot and I just threw it away yeah you said tot okay <laughs> all right so then now we're gonna do this we're gonna using it just pick it up just make sure that you get a good consistency of See the high up four strips at the same time, four lines at the same time, and then pick them up. This is just try to get a pick, uh, the good consistency of the weaver gel. Okay, and you can keep going like that. Really fast. Super easy. See, just 
three strokes, then I get some of the lines done. And you can go back and do on the other side, but I'm gonna pop in the lamb and key it first because I don't wanna mess it up. For 60 seconds. <coughs> I'm gonna wipe it up because maybe I will do it on the other side, yeah? Mm -hmm. On the other side, and then we can um, put the uh, reindeer. So we have both different, if you wanna work with Mix, customize your own uh, reindeer. Oh my gosh, hi Yvonne, it's fabulous. You will love it, I promise. This is the best thing that you're doing it. Like, it's hello, Merry Christmas to me, you know. But from this kit, you will do so much with this. You know, you will, even if you want to do a basic, simple design to really, really dramatic crystal. I'm so excited for you, Yvonne. I know you will love it. There's special, we work so hard, the special to pick the, the most popular best-selling crystal. So then it's so easy for you already. And then you can play with all different designs. All right, so I'm gonna do it again. I wanna put it away, but I'm gonna do it again. I can do it again if once. So okay, again, if any of you have been tuning in and missing me on that, so I'm gonna do, pick up this. Four toothpick, you can do five. I did some of the clients, I did five of them. And then you can do four, pick it up. Go the other direction. Pick it up again. Go the other direction. Just crease cloth. Yep, just simple like that. Mm -hmm. Do another one on the bottom. There you go. Just like that. I want to pop in the lamb and cure it really quick. Thank you, Lily. Mm -hmm. You just do it away if you don't want it using it. I'm going to just close this. I don't want it to be here by the... <coughs> under my LED lamp, like at works and your lamp table. This one, the looks I did with this too. Whatever background you're going to use. You're going to use a background, the blue, then I'll use white and red. If you're doing a green, I would do is red and white. And if you're doing, uh, we did gold and we did red and white. So whatever, however you like to doing it, it works both at the same. All right, so then we want to move this one here if you miss me uh earlier the designs that i did you can look it back later on instagram you can look it on story time at last 24 hours or you can watch on um facebook we we'll always have it up there or if you are in a nail pro you can watch us on uh, crystal nails obsessions uh page group page for you to share all your beautiful works or if you have any questions also, you can watch us on YouTube. If you type in Glitz Accessory and such, it's going to be popping up all the videos. Um, yeah, but then it's also, it's going under Nancy, but then it's going with the Glitz Accessory and such. You can search as. Fabulous. Thank you, Lily. Look at this. Now we're going to do Rudolph's. We're going to do Reindeer. Okay. And back to that kit again. <coughs> Yeah. Oh, hold on. This kids again. So the reindeer we're gonna do. Now so we're gonna put it a glue gel on. 5G. Where's that at? So I'm showing you guys the one I already finished. <laughs> and then the twin tip brush again. It's okay, I have the other one. It's really condensed. It doesn't uh, sell level. So then it's perfect for flat back and uh, 3D. 
crystals as well as all the charms, which is I'm talking about the charms on my nails is staying on for three weeks already and it's haven't got any uh, prime or popping up at all. Just make sure that yeah, I need uh, more and more glue gel. So I'm gonna apply it all. Blend them out. You don't have to like apply completely just because I'm doing a live and sometimes I just getting my nails like all different blinged out. I just want to make sure that I have enough glue gels. But if you work on just the middle of the nails, you can just get away with the middle of the nails and apply the glue gel there without have to apply the whole entire the nails. But I get an idea so I'm gonna play some of the crystals um along with the weaver gels. That's why I am applying the whole nails. So then I won't take a chance to miss anything uh no white top coat on the top again and just float it on the top of the glue gel i haven't cured anything yet i'm gonna cure it after i place the crystal on it all right <coughs> so now we're gonna do Just something like a Rudolph Brindia right there. And it had a big red, red nose right there. He's got a big, big one. And some. The bar right there. I hope I have it enough. If not, I'm going to ask Lulu. Okay. Hello Instagram, hi Facebook. Thank you so much for welcome back to our live video. You see, we always have it. The day is on Thursday and Friday. This time we're doing it a little bit, all different live videos. We'll try to doing a lot and then we can share with you a lot of tip and trick. It's how to using uh, glitz accessory and such because we want you to be successful. Your success is our success, so. Love to seeing it with you. Sucks. Okay. Sucks. And let me see. I'm gonna put this one in there. I'm gonna fix it later before I'm curing it. Like right there. Uh, I need. Lee, can I grab some of. <coughs> Of my uh, tray there. Can I get another? The frame. <coughs> you see? This one is the metal uh, frame, I think. Oh, can I get one of this? Guys, is our blue moon. I said, oh, I want to show you this. Let me see how is that. Maybe one of this? It looks cute, right? Oh my god, I love this. Look at that. She's so cute. Hold on. Maybe I should put two of this on the side. It looks like she had an earring. These are ears. On the side. Looks cute. She can be bedazzled up with the crystal. So cute. Thank you so much, sweetie. She's so cute. Don't you like it? Yeah. Okay, here, look. Her ears, she's even have a crystal on her ears, too. But this one needs to be on this side. And then if you're happy with this, you put it on. But I think what I'm doing, I'm going to do it really quick. I'm going to do it really, really quick. Um, can I get some of this? I'm gonna do a really 
quick some of the tiny little emerald crystal And a smaller one. Smaller the better. And this thing is smaller. This one. And then I put some SS4. You can dress it more if you want to. <coughs> Kiss me. I didn't want to put the red on because we have a weaver gel, the red, and then we have the red nose already. All right, so I'm gonna fix. Yeah, and like it. Okay, I'm gonna fix it so then. Okay, I'm gonna pull it off from the camera because it's hard to see, but I will be just completely back. In the meantime, you can take a look at the um, crystal kit. All right. Okay. Any question, just comment below. You can ask any question, don't hesitate. I'm gonna answer the question when I cure the nails in a minute. Right there, you think it's good? It's good, then I'm gonna pop in the lamb, wipe up on the side, so make sure that it's not gonna change the shape of your nails. And then pop in the lamb. For 60 seconds. Oh my god, this is awesome. All right. Hello, Jijuk, how are you? Thanks so much for tuning in. I know you get like a lot of fun things going on this weekend. The stews hanging out here with me and watching me doing a live tutorial. It's mean a lot to me. Thank you, everyone. We did like two nails really quick and fast. Any of the nails you would like to see because I am going to see you again tomorrow. But if anyone want to see anything that you wanted me to show, Oh, you know what? I think I do have time. We're gonna we're gonna um doing a quick fusioning. How about that? We're doing this colors and then we're doing a fusioning in the bottles. Like, is that right? It's a colors for Christmas. And then we'll see. I can't wait. Yes. Oh my goodness. Okay, look at that. is all using it, uh, the main crystals from our uh, Black Friday Exclusives Crystal Kit. So now it's going in with the precision glue. Take the cap up and then you know, when you're gonna feel it first, don't squeeze it yet until you feel it. Okay, it's scratchy right here. I feel it's scratchy right here. The clients also feel it too when you feel it in. So then now I'm feeling it all of this and make sure because I don't want to flood it my crystal and I don't want to have all the big lumps of, of glue gels and that it take away from the look of the crystal and it's just, you know, it's not, it looks attractive. I'm going to feel in. And then when you cure with the clients, you make sure, you make sure you're going to be, um, Tell them to rock the hand back and forth. Yeah. 
and I think a little one is sealed really well because we did a glue gels and a top coat. So then the, the little one, the SS368, you don't have to worry about it. It's already sealed really well. This one, sometimes they're catching on the clothes or the scratch themselves. You're going to seal it on the end. That's why they won't um, scratch it. I think it's good. I'm gonna pop in the lamp for 60 seconds and then you'll be done. I like that dog. Wow. So cute. <coughs> yes. So don't forget and don't do this cap away. It's gonna last a long time. It's the little bottles, it's going a long way. Cap on. It's going to be uh, your best friends on your station. Same thing you can do your reindeer on this background. I did it on the top of the goal. So, okay. So, we're going to show in the fusion name. Let's move the kids away first. Then we'll show fusioning, And then we'll come back with the kids later. <coughs> Let me put this here first with the fusioning I, if I want to do just this two I just use this two colors and then oh we're talking about diamond dust fixing all right after you apply the gel polish you apply the matte top coat right away this I'm using the matte top coat and then Kia for a 60 second so same with dipping powders. After you finish with the dipping powders, you're gonna put the base coat, which is the base gels, the LD gels, and cure for 10 seconds. Then put the matte top coat on, cure for 60 seconds. I'm gonna using this two things. I'm gonna using it today. It's crystal clear and then the Bogdol colors. So we're gonna tap it on. Oh, it's just so pretty. Let me see. And it's just randomly. You don't have to like doing a perfect because this will help. And then also I have on my size, I'm going to holding, oh, sorry, number, it's not number, but this is the 3D brush. Maybe tomorrow we can do with the 4D gels, how to have like that. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna tap it in using my crystal clear. This is solution, that's all you need. You don't need anything, it's crazy fancy. And then it's just tap it. It's blend it out for yourself, for you already. Wipe it off on the piece of paper. You don't want it to be contaminating back into your crystal clear. And if you want to make the veins, you can details a little bit on this. Just draw it. If you want a vein to look the way you want to look, you just need to draw it there. Just randomly, you don't have to be perfect because the marble look is suddenly looks perfect all together. You can add the green on it too if you want to. Let me do some green on it, thinking green, we did it yesterday. It looks so beautiful.
I'm wiping my brush because I don't want the brush to get mm, to my red. <coughs> I think I'm gonna let it air dry for a minute. You can do working on the veins if you want to. But I'm not worried too much about the veins. I am doing it because I'm gonna show you something is really cool. Because sometimes if I work on the vein too pretty and I'm gonna cover it, so I don't want it to be happen. Or you can do it um, to show. Maybe I can show you one of the flowers on the top first and then <coughs> to doing the vents is later. You can do it for something that's so simple. But I'm not trying to working it, making a lot of veins because I am drawing the veins right now. As Chan Fu Foy, premium Chan Fu Foy, I hold Chan Fu Foy. I just need a little bit piece of it, like just a drop down in my plate right here. And twin tip brush. I'm gonna using a twin tip brush now. And I'm gonna using instead of this side, I'm gonna using a light brush. Close this one because I don't want to spill it because I did it yesterday. Don't want to happen again. So I'm just load my brush with some of my premiums. I hold Chan for Foy. This is awesome. It's just Chan for image or anything you want in like just a second. So I'm gonna draw the veins along with my uh, marble designs. Can you see it once again? Yeah. Let's do it once again. I think I'm good and I will pop in a lamb to keep it for about uh, 30 seconds. I only need 30 seconds. You don't need to take me longer. I hold Chan for Foy is 60 seconds, but the premiums Chan for Foy is only take 30 seconds. So I'm happy with the veins I draw. I'm gonna pop in the lamb for about 30 seconds. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry guys, just keep coughing because I don't know, it's just dry and just a dry cup. I haven't been stuck in a cup drop all the time. This nails are done. I feel in a precision glue already and this is the two designs that we done. I'm so in love with this. Hello Hollywood Pinky. Thanks so much for tuning in, sweetie. Hope you all have a great Thanksgiving. Thank you so much for tuning in back in. Uh, we're doing a different live video like we're gonna do today, tomorrow, and Monday. So then just to try to share with you so much about the Black Friday exclusive crystal kits that we're gonna using that one to do some of the designs. Just 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. yeah. I know, but I put my hand in here. 30 seconds. Do you have a big piece? Where the other pieces so the glue for this one, sweetie. Um pearl lash nails. That's glue for this one? Glue for this one. Or are you talking about glue for this one? This one. 
Oh, for the crystal, for the right zone, for the crystal. Yes, you have to using, that's come with your kit. Remember when you order it, uh, pearl, pearl lash nails? Yvonne, thank you so much, sweetie. She said, I love them. All right, I'm gonna wait for a minute for Instagram. Sorry, it's just because it's over an hour. Instagram, it just turned off. So I'm gonna show you. I didn't wanna do it right away. Um, so then I can show the Instagram. This after I hear 30 seconds, I'm using this I hold premium chan for foy. And I just apply just a little bit. Put one drop in here and then just pick up with my precise. Uh, I'm sorry, with my twin tip brush. So press the piece of the foil. Make sure you feel. I feel it is really cool and tight in here. So let me show you again. Are you ready? Are you ready? So just seeing it's all the designs that you're gonna need right there. All right. <coughs> all right. Ready? Ta-da! Look at that, all the veins. You can draw the the way the vein is, whatever, however you would like. After you're done with all different, like sometimes I do the fusion thing, I do more than just one colors. So you can do yellow, you can do hot pink and blue, you do whatever. And then after that, you can just apply that and then draw the veins. So what you want, you can do less veins or you can do more. It's really, it's up to you. And then after that, I'm going to using a non-white top coat to promote, to protect that. Oh, you know what? See, I have um, pearl lash nails here. I'm going to put some crystal in here, okay? I'm gonna put just some crystal on it <clears throat> to this design. It's already beautiful. If you are finished, you can just put the non-white top on here for 60 seconds and you are done. But you wanna add some crystal on it. So here's the best time to doing it. You're gonna using a glue gel, condensed glue gels. And it's really thick density. So then it doesn't self level. You can use it for both. You're gonna use it both for flat back or uh, 3D. Just a small amount because I am going to use it on just right here. You know what? I'm just using it right there. I'm gonna use it just on the side because I wanna just cast case down because I don't wanna take away from my veins. It's beautiful. Right there, right there, perfect. Okay, cap on. You don't want your LED light to kill it, so make sure you cap on and your brush wipe up and it caps the brush on because you don't want the LED lights. It's gonna kill your brush. So, non wipe top. Okay, pull lash line. You can do it on the top of any design. Like I just finished with my, um, Fusionings and a uh, chanfer foil. So now we're gonna put the crystal on. So now I'm gonna cap all of this, but then in this part, uh, my nails it's had the glue gels on it. So I'm gonna apply the crystal on it. This is the best time to doing it. So here is our beautiful kit. If you haven't get time to check it out, just make sure you check it out. Don't miss out this opportunity because it's only happened on Black Friday. I saying it because I'm meaning it. Okay. Feel like we did this one already. We did this one. Media Luna. Um, maybe we're using. There's so many shape. I like to get them all. I don't know. Okay, here. Maybe I'll do this. Did we do this yesterday? Maybe we didn't. Mm. No, I think no. Okay, right here. 
this is perfect drop that's one of my favorites one this is all best selling guys so if you haven't yet chance to take a look on you can search it on um special black friday special i'm sorry holiday special and you will see all black friday that we did it for you it ready for you how long does the glue keep the gems on so it lasts up to three to six weeks some of the clients that we uh using it we did so many it's just like i would say that longest time that they're going on vacation for six weeks they come back all the crystals and um dragon scale is there so but make sure your kids under proper you know lambs and then we're doing i'm going to show you how you can tell the clients who kill them so this on the side again is SS10. I'm gonna get some SS8. Oh. Yeah. I just want just a little bit on the side. I don't wanna keep it. I don't wanna cover all uh, and tie my veins that I just draw beautiful. Oh, you know what? Be honest, it's so beautiful when you add just a little bit of crystal on it, just make it so much better it already looks good it's, but it's gonna be better let me share quick <coughs> i'm so sorry can you grab me the quick uh cough drop You know you can do it more is here is ss6 right there and now it's my fun part i got to play with my uh, little metal beads okay it's here tip and tricks metal beads uh twin tip brush i'm gonna use this side okay so if you haven't seen that how this one hold this one one this, if you get the twin tip brush, don't confuse yourself. This is a thicker band right here. It's going to be for the bigger brush. And then it's a thinner band. It's going to be for the light brush. So it's really compact. You get two pieces in one price. So I'm going to pick up some of my extra and excess uh, glue gel and top coat. Open it. One. And then pick up my beads. And I'll play it right there. And play them right there without touching my uh, crystals. I haven't cured anything yet, okay? Um, is a pearl lash light. I haven't, I haven't cured anything yet. So there's still on the top of the glue gels and all right if i need more then i can always go back and pick up so i put my tray in here because i don't want to put on the top of my crystals so my tray i'm going to show you my tray of my beads is right here all right now let me let me move them around first before i pick up some more because it doesn't look like attractive right now. Okay, move them back in. So usually the best tip and trick when you're doing that to make to make the beads just looks like a jewelry, place them between the connection of the crystal. It's the the best uh, spot for it to be. It's the same thing like when you look at the jewelry piece of jewelry that how they place them really nicely. They make it look so uh, fancy. So it doesn't look like you just pile all the crystal or uh, the stone on each other. This one, let me see. If you're happy with this, you can call it good. But if not, you can keep going is no one can stop you from doing crystal because i love it i can be here all night long and play with crystal i eat crystal for breakfast lunch and dinner the clients seeing it because every time they see me they want 
can I get the same nail that you have? And she said, sure. See, so you upsell your service at the salon already. Buying just doing what you love and your passion, you're showing it. And your passion, you're happy. You always enjoy what you're doing because you learn something new, so you apply it right away. And then upon seeing it, say, oh, can I get the same? Sure. And at that time, at that point, they don't mind that they have to pay extra for it. So, yeah, so this is nails. If you're doing for the clients, they are so cool because there's so many going on right here. You did, what you did in here? You did fusioning, and then after that, you did, um, and then you did uh, chanfer foys veins, and then you did crystal. So three different is, um, step procedures here. That is so true. Yep. I'm wearing this all the time and every time, like even my toes, they came in with just the regulars, all the stuff, love it. And they came in with just the regular um, a pedicure and they see my toenails with uh, chromatics in there and a gel polish and then a crystal. They have to, can't go without just a uh, solid nail polish. So they have to add a gel polish on, chromes on and crystal. So you make extra on your services. That's so fancy. Thanks so much, Lily. Lily was enjoying it. You like this? So yeah, cute. Okay, like pop in the lamb. So if you're happy with this, pop in the lamb. Purse last night. Did I do it? Did I um, help yours with help out with the answer the question that how you apply the glue gels? So now after I help you with this, I'm popping the lamb for sixty seconds. In the lamp for 60 seconds. Does the wax pen need to be replaced ever or do they need it last forever? No, it's please ask any questions. Goodness, nails. We do have the replacement for the wax tip, but to me, this will last you a long way. Here's the tip and trick, okay? So don't just randomly tot it. If you get this, this come with a, a plastic box and a little holder. Do not throw that away. Usually I do, I just put right back in the cap, in the box. Can you show me one of the um, pickers, new ones from the cap, from the, wanna grab that one. So then you place right on there because this one over a period of time, like if you put in the desk and your desk gets so much dust after you doing the clients, like you take off their gel polish or they take off um, acrylic, <coughs> the dust gonna get in here, so only you do is just gently clean it right here. And then the tip of it, excuse me, I'm sorry, I'm just keep coughing over you guys. And then you clip it and you clean, that's good. Don't let the dust in here because then it's going to ruin it. And then it'll last long. I have one of them that I'm using for two years. But as long as you don't get too much dust in there, too much dust in there, it's going to dry out your wax. So like this, it's going to come in the box like this. Just place in the plastic one and put back in the box and then it's prevent from the uh, dust. And all like if it getting outsized and it's just drying it, your wax out. So keep it in here, it will last or even a long time. Or if you needed it, there's like the replacements for the wax like this. We we have that to matching with ours. So to just take it off and then replace it. But before you replace, it's gonna last you a long time. Yeah. We like to share all the tips and tricks on how you can just, you know, utilize it and you don't waste your money. That's perfect. Thank you, Lily. This is a look after we cure for 60 seconds. This is one right here. That's sorry. Instagram. Bye, Lily. Okay. See you on Monday. Have a nice Sunday off. Oops, sorry. Is it cover over? Yeah, it's good, it's good, it's good. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, Instagram and Facebook. All right, so now we're gonna do precision glue again. Don't do this cap away, keep this. You're gonna do it, feel this one first. This one is already dry. I keep it for 60 seconds, so it dries. So when you keep this one, the tip and trick, you're gonna have the clients rock the hand back and forth to help all that, the LED lights to keep 
even the edges on the sides of the crystals. Sometimes if you don't, it's going to pop up because it's not going to cure, especially if your lamp is like, it's been using for a long time is over the a limit of the hours that they are supposed to it will do that but if you're using a good proper lamp so i'm using to be honest i'm using all different lamps at the salon uh at the good lamp which is i'm using akira skies oli cnds all the good lamps so like anything any other lamps is good too but make sure that you get to check it. Sometimes the bulbs is dying and it doesn't work. You need to make sure that. So just rock the nails back and forth. And so then that way it's got to cure right here. It needs to be cured. If not, it's still wet in here that it's going to pop off. So you just need to rock it back and forth. And then the, the UV rays will cure right here. Right here. Instead of just on the top down. And now... Pre-season glue, I took the lids off, the cap off, and then now I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna feel it first. This one is nice and smooth. This one right here is getting a little bit scratchy here. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just feel it in. So right here, scratchy, so I'm gonna feel it. My glue gel's in there. And then it's right here. And then right there, so then it won't catch you on their hair or their uh, sweater or their clothes, whatever is gonna, not gonna, it's just help all the crystals stay intact. And it's the smaller bottles go a long way. Tip and trick, if you accidentally squeeze too much out using a twin tip brush on the light brush you have with this alone, just blend them out so then it doesn't look really uh, lumpy on the designs. And then we do have a question from a, a customer who asking if you're using a matte top coat. If you're using a matte top coat, what you do doing, you put the precision glue on it and then you go back with the matte top coat and then you cure. So it's going to give you a perfect matte without showing any precision glues at all. Let me hold it right here. So then both Facebook and Instagram can see. I think I should do the Facebook. A little bit bigger. Can Facebook see me? Yeah. Right here, Facebook should be right here. Yeah. Perfect. All right, pop in the lamp for 60 seconds. And then you'll be done with that design. So all the designs that I'm using, is we're using ours, uh, all the crystal special shapes from Black Friday special crystal kits that is designed for you with all the top selling crystals and is the, the special promotion is still going on now until Monday at 11.59 uh, of uh, set, I'm sorry, a Pacific Central Time. So you have a lot of plenty of time and uh, get it when you're seeing it. That is something that you've been looking for. You get haven't get chance to try out the products. It's a great time to even pick out one items for you to check it out or get the beautiful kits with all different crystals and the kits that come with the glue gels, the 5G glue gels, and with the crystal pickers which is condensed glue gels. And this crystal pickers. Also, you're gonna get your two trays and the scoop. So then you can easy for you to get the crystal out without scratching them. And let's see, showing the design. I'm gonna cap all my brush on, so don't, um, open all the caps on the station especially when you have a busy holiday season coming everything is just like it's so busy and it's messed up in the station don't worry about it. just close all the cap then it's gonna save you a long way three design oh my god it's so festive and then also you can do this in the purple if you want to and then you can put any other but i just sharing with you that how much you can do like how much many designs like how much crystal out of the kit and how many designs you can do with all different shapes so 
Let me show it closer. Just amazing. Thank you so much. Yassi. 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 No, Yassi, not yet. Okay, Yassi. She's always correcting me. It's okay. I love my daughters. She's she's my good existence, helpers, lover, supporters, business partner. She's like, Mommy, you need to show your face more. I said, yes, I am going to. All right. Okay. We're doing this. Maybe I should put in some... Oh my god, oh. Good at nails. Yes, if you have any questions, okay? Don't hesitate to ask, because if you don't ask, we don't know. So, and uh, I would love to share more and more. There's a lot of different um, designs we're gonna share tomorrow. What did you guys wanna see tomorrow? Do you want me to do designs flower with 3D? Uh, uh, with the 4D gels? Yes, it's <coughs> oh, thank you so much, Henry. Yes, I'm lucky to have her this week because she has uh, no school this week for Thanksgiving week. So she's like to come and join in helping me out. I think she's enjoying it. She's, I love her company. So if you have any questions for the products, any anything you could ask me, cause you know, I'm here for you. Tomorrow I'll be back to and Monday. So then we can do some cool different designs with using this kit. I will try to share so many different designs as many as possible. And then I don't know when the kit is gonna be sold out, but I just wanna make sure that you get all of these eyes that you would using for your crystals different shape um then you can use them when you get them in hand you know what to place with them how to do it and like this this design you can easily is you know chalk the clients between at least 15 to 20 dollars if not more uh it, it depends on your salon location because you have your fusioning, you have chamfer voice, and you have a crystal, so it's good designs on it. So, oh yeah, okay, good designs. We're gonna do a three D pencil. We have a lot of different um designs tutorial in that. Can wait until tomorrow. You wanna see anything else? Of course, it's gonna be fun. Okay. We wanna do the three D tomorrow. How about that? Because they're gonna not overwhelming for you ladies to learn so they can go back. I'm just wiping all my residues of the wax on my crystals. They're always a beautiful shade. Yeah, so please tune in for tomorrow video. Today I did three nails, beautiful nails. And if you wanna see anything, you just comment it, let me know so we can work on it. Ta -da. Thank you, you guys. I was really, really happy that you, everybody, tuning in. Um, I'm so enjoying you guys. Hope you enjoying it as much, you know, as I do. And tomorrow we'll come back with uh, 3D. Yeah. 3D. How 3D? Yeah. Huh? Mm -hmm. 3D, but if you do then right now I need to get them I need to get some of the uh, products ready like all that so I don't want everybody is waiting I just get need to get preps like the products okay. I need to ready in really hand get. so we're gonna do it tomorrow so we have something is fun we, tomorrow we're gonna do is 3d uh, flowers using our 4d gels and then we're gonna apply the crystal along with that let me show you some of the designs that we have done with the 3D as well. This one is, is three designs that we just finished. I'm laying here just in case you have any question. And then 
This one that we did in a different sessions of 3Ds. So we have a 3D. So many. We have 3Ds that we're using it to make a print setters from our 4D gels. It's really simple and it's so easy to do. It's great for beginners as well as advanced nail technician. It's beginner is really cool that you don't have to worry about, oh my God, I put place one bead in the dry. I couldn't even sculpting it. With the 40s, with Gliss 40, it's so flexible and it's so consistency. You don't even need to get any solution, but just a oh, plain water. So then you we don't need to using any alcohol or anything to do it to clean the brush because that's gonna melt to the gel. So what we do is just using a water. I'm gonna show you tomorrow how technique is super easy and to achieve this looks is no uh, in no time or any flowers that we can do. All right, everyone. I hope you really enjoy. Hey, Zaglo, how are you? But yes. You know, it's we didn't have a schedule, but we would, I would love to share with everyone. So I will make sure that everybody is already receiving their kits when they start ordering from Wednesday. Then we have a lot of questions, a lot of DMs. We want to make sure that you are, we are the same page. You know how you can use all the different crystals, all different designs, that crystal that you have on this kit. So I, we would like you to be success and then to do, to know how to work with this, to be in a proper way. So, and some of the, like a lot of orders gone already received on, on Wednesday. Some clients already tagging us. And then we also have so many orders out yesterday and also today. So it, it probably you'll receive it on Monday. But if any of you that would love to have a hands on our crystals and some products, it's a great time to do because you get 30% off until Monday or white supply lasts. We try so much so hard that every single of you get to able to get something and then get good price. So then you can play, take it back to your business and make a lot of money. Make a lot of monies for the holiday. I have been having trouble to place my order with the code. It didn't let me. Uh, Aglos, you don't need to do any code at all. So if you do, if you place any order, all of your order from now until Monday is going to be automatically, when you place them, when you're ready to check out, is everything will take taken off 30% off. You don't need to put any code on. Well, when you have a code on, that will help you with your uh, free shipping. But if you have uh, your orders over $150, it's automatically is gonna take in down 30%. And just look a lot of closer, some of the products that really good sales that's going up to over 50% of the sales. So just keep looking at all different. And if you wanna look for the special holidays that you click on the search bar, say, Holiday specials is gonna pop up all different cool, different products in there for you. Yes, you try it again if you have a hard time and then you still having a, a, a troubleshooting, you can always DM us and we can be on the phone helping out with your order for you, okay? Yes, no, thanks so much for your love and support. We're so grateful to have all of you. Fabulous. So here is the some of the designs that we did before. Okay, we'll pass this. It's fall, but it's so beautiful. Okay, we'll knock this down. This is a Christmas coming. Okay, go in that way. There's so many. Oh, this is a different um different reindeer that we did. Chancofoy Christmas tree using our mix, mega mix of all the crystals. All right, let's see, uh, I wanna show something. And then we did the live video yesterday. If you miss us, <coughs> the video is gonna be up on YouTube today. But uh, then you can see if you miss us from Instagram and Facebook, you can view it from the Facebook. Uh, this design yesterday we did. This beautiful designs that we did yesterday for, for Christmas. There's so many, so I would like to being sharing so many different designs much as possible so then that way you can get all different designs and get an ideas and bring it back to your salons and make good money for the seasons and 
living a good life. Here, yesterday I did this. This one, I don't know. I like, we need to do like a contest of what is your favorite design because I love them all. I don't know. I can't, don't make me pick because I don't know which one to pick. I'll pick them all. <laughs> I know. Oh God. So you were changing, you switching your names on it. You switching your name on that. Olga, right? Did I say Olga? Olga. Olga. Yeah, but then you're searching on the Instagram. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, love. Thank you, everyone. I'm so happy that you tuning in with me tonight. Yes, it's a great to be. Um, yes, I'm going to go back and watch them all. Yes, so if you lady watch them, if you have any questions, concern, anything with re regarding to uh, crystal placements or how... Like send us the message. I said, how you did this? How did I do it right? Just just send us the message. We'll be here for you, okay? And sometimes we have a congestion of all the DM, but we try to get every single uh, question. So we're gonna help support everyone. Oh my God, so then so many is painful of it looks like. Beautiful. Yeah, they're all so beautiful. Okay. Hope everyone enjoy your Saturday night. I will see you tomorrow night on Sunday and Monday. So then I can share as much as possible. And then Jenny will be back with everyone on Thursday and Friday. So from now on, we can do all bling set up for Christmas nails. So if you haven't get chance to look at on that special kit, there's so many special. It's just is here that I just want to show like with us, we can do it so simple that to create uh, different designs really fast quick we take no times and the crystal was placed on at last up to three to six weeks and the clients will be happy and they're so sparkle so a uh, quick uh, just before we wrap up this kit is if you search on it you search it on this holiday special it's gonna pop up with so many different kits so we're seeing it a black friday exclusive crystal kit which is this one and by the time you're checking out, it's knocked out to one thirty, the value of four hundred dollars, and you get it for one thirty nine thirty cents, I think, which is awesome. It's never happened like that, but because of Black Friday, we would like everyone to get this. I just took it off earlier. If you missed me with the beginning of the live video, I took it off from this. You also received this. You received this one, the Diamond Dust Pixie that have the um, Christmas collection I took it off from this case the the box and you also receive your 5g glue gel your crystal pickers and your two tray and a scoop all right so that is just the one I did a lot crystal with that ones so I will see you tomorrow. I mean, it's hard to say bye because I want to be here all night and then sharing all of the different designs and stuff. So, but I have to let you go because then you can enjoy the Saturday night with your family. I will see you tomorrow. Thanks so much for tuning in. I love you all and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs>